Hey guys, it's Stefan from Tutorial Australia, and today I'm going to show you how you can download streaming videos straight to your Mac or PC. As you can see here, Jackster is the program I'm recommending. This is for both platforms, although I do recommend this mainly for Mac people, because there's a few other programs you might prefer on Windows, although if you are on a Windows, I do recommend this too, because it's a great all-around program. I can give you a snapshot now of what it's about. So, if you hop onto jackster.com, you can see here there's three bars. There's the Try It Free, the Learn More, and the Buy Now. So, if you just want to follow along and not download anything, that's fine, because I'll show you what is about. But if you want to try it for free first, that's, that's fine. You can download it and follow along too. So, first thing I want to outline, Jackster is super quick, fast, and easy, as it says in the bottom here. Uh, I can give you an example. I think I downloaded a 1.5 gigabyte video in about 10 minutes, which is much quicker than keepfit.com and our web streaming download sites. Uh, Jax is very fast and easy. So once you've tried it for free and put it onto your applications or you just want to follow along, you can head out of Google Chrome. And I'm going to minimize that and I'm going to hop on to Jackstar. So simple, quick, direct program. As you can see, it is very simple, nice and easy. Once you click start, what it does is it starts to monitor. It basically puts Jackster into the monitoring position. What this means is whenever uh, you go onto Google or use a browser and you hit a video, it knows and it will start to download. Monitoring just means it's following your computer's progress and once it picks up on a video, it will start to download. So now to remember, if you want to download something, click start first and have the blue icon and then from there you can start to download. And just remember, click monitoring before you hit the video. Okay, so once you've done that, you can hit start. And we can go on to today. And you can see there's previous downloads I've got. Um, but once you've done that, in the top bar, there should be a symbol that says on. And it also has different settings, so you can stop up there. Just remember, once you're downloading and you're finished, click stop. Because if you go on to another video, it will download that super quick. Because Jackson doesn't miss much. It will download everything or every video you go to. So if you're downloading large files, just remember to click it off. Okay, so once you've clicked it on, you can see it's blue, and it's also blue in the bottom left, so you can flip that on and off. Okay, so once you have start monitoring, I can give an example of what it's about. So we can go and minimize Jackstar, and we can go on to any browser you want to use. And I can just give you an example on one of my videos, just hit any video on YouTube, and I'll just click on one. Okay, click on this one, and that will start to play, and I'll pause it, and as you can see in the background, Jaxter has picked it up and started to already download. Nice and quick, it's downloading, it says the estimated time of um, arrival basically, and it converts it for you. As you can see, a default conversion, you can set it. It's nice and quick, so if that's for a six minute video, that's super quick compared to some other websites. So you can see how fast it does pick up on what you're watching. So if you are downloading large files, be careful if you have super quick internet because it will go through and a click of the fingers. It's that quick juxtap. So once you see here, it's complete. This video has completed at 8.48 p.m. It's also converted for me. So down here, you can change that to the default, whatever you want to change it to, PlayStation 3, PS Vita, uh, music file, depending on your preference. So we can have a look here, it's complete, and we can hit to the search destination. And you can see it's put it into the converted folder. Okay, so it's in the converted folder now on Jackstar. And you can see that's the video I clicked on, the best render settings, and it's put it into an MOV for me because I'm using a Mac. So that's so quick, already converted for me. And we can click on that. And you can see the video opens. Super quick, nice and easy video save to your computer, Mac or PC. So that's basically a snapshot of what Jackster's like. Uh, you can see, super quick, if you want to download large files, I, uh, I thoroughly suggest this program because co comparing to keepvid.com and some other web streaming uh, downloaders, they're so slow compared to Jackster. If you're in a rush and you want to get a movie on straight away, say a movie didn't work and you want to download another one, quick smart, go on to Jackster, hit monitoring, go to your movie and download it. Um, YouTube is just an example. It downloads most uh, streaming videos. You can have a look at uh, the back on um, 
the JAXA website and it will show you all the lists of downloads and also anything you want to know. You can also post me a question on the comments section and I'll be able to answer. You will also probably have a different version of JAXA to me. I have an older version, so yours is probably up to date and uh, fixed with bugs. The only kind of con with JAXA is it sometimes has some glitches and doesn't convert to what you want it to and sometimes downloads over. I've had some experiences where it doesn't actually download, it downloads more and then has errors. But other than that, once it's working, it's a great program, so simple to use. So everyone can use this program. So easy to download your videos. Say you post a video on YouTube and you're going away to a place that doesn't have internet and you want to download it, you can take it, download it, put it on your hard drive and take it away with you. That's how simple it is, only in a few minutes. Hour long videos do not even take very long. As you can see, it's so quick and downloads and converts. So that's basically what Jaxter is. Stream videos straight to your computer, Mac or PC. Jaxter.com will show you and you can try, check out the facts on there and also post any questions you want to me. I can help you out. I'm happy to help. It's a tutorial page as you can see. I love helping people. So post me a question. And as you can see here, as I said before, I'm gonna click it back to off because if I click on another video it will start downloading because it's that quick and you won't even notice. Sometimes I've downloaded five videos without even noticing because I haven't clicked it off. So in the top bar you can see it's off now so just remember that. So if you enjoy this tutorial guys go ahead and download Jaxter, try it for free and buy it. Uh, leave a comment on what you think about it. It's a great program, just a couple bugs it still has. Um, streaming videos quick, smart to your computer, Mac or PC. So thanks for watching guys, if you enjoyed please share and subscribe, that's about it, I'll see you guys later.